Welcome to the Throga channel. Today with Good us to is Johnny Cummings Jr. And I am your host, one of your co-hosts, rather, Richard Fink IV. Uh, tonight our playlist consists of a little uh, Rachmaninoff, followed yes. by some Bach, and uh, a concerto by Beethoven. With a little twist in that none of that Ooh. is true. It's actually, <laughs> it's actually Otto seeking crime and punishment. And I thought, perhaps we need a little downtime, a little rest for our ears before going into the, the rabbit hole of chaos and confusion. Uh, yes, and please try my sweaty balls. Don't you know the oh, reference Oh, Saturday that? Night Live. Yes. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? I don't want you to actually try my, no. Um. <laughs> Just say your line. Say your line. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Hit like and subscribe and ring the bell. Richard, it's a very special day. Why is that? And for all special days, I like to bring out the big guns as far as my wardrobe is concerned. I got my Cobra Kai shirt, my Johnny Lawrence special. And it's blue to, on uh, blue. You got like the whole, if I blue screened you blue. right now, hold on. Do I have that option? This is pre-recorded. I could do it in post. Here is Johnny blue screened out with a fantastic image. Now. Okay, now I'm driving a car. Now I'm flying. No, too much editing. Too much editing. Now I'm slaying a dragon. <laughs> no. that's also, how a dragon if, <laughs> if you're new here and you'd like to support this page, because clearly it's a good idea, uh, be sure to check out the link below where you can buy us a coffee and become a silver, gold, or diamond thronely member for added perks and also lets us know that you like Auto, and we should do more of these videos. Also, be sure to check yes. out throga.com where you can learn more about your voice in the seven dimensions of singing with our online singing course at the Vocal Gym. Yep. All right, let's go, Otto. A great shirt for a great artist. Can't wait. Yes. It's been a long so, time. we're not going to be able to, well, I was going to say we're not going to be able to see much, but we don't actually know what she looks like anyway. <laughs> so, we're definitely not going to see her. Good. Well, it's about the music here anyway. So, <clears throat> let's yep. go. I like the drama. Always drama with her. <clears throat> All right, so I, I think we have a lyric video. I didn't know what we were going to be watching here, obviously. So, um, a, any initial thoughts? Uh, just not surprised <laughs> because she's uh, just, it's shocking, but I'm not surprised by my shock. She's yeah. Just, it just goes for it. Like, I would love to be a fly in that brain, if that's an actual saying. A fly I... on the wall of that brain. <laughs> it's just as. Because, I, like, just the thought process, because it's just like, there, there's no filter there. She just, no. she has an artistic instinct, uh, you know, an inspiration, and she just lets it out. That's it, it. At, at the risk of comparing artists, because they're two completely different artists in so many ways, but we've said a similar thing to watching you, with just that, yeah. the willingness to just like, here's my idea, here's my voice, and just completely unfiltered and you just it, the rawness raw is such a good word for for Otto. It, it's just the willingness to be that raw with skill i mean she has chops as chaotic as everything is it is her sense of timing and vowel shapes in the transitions between different textures of her voice in the same breath one after another is not mm -hmm. an easy feat to especially to replicate 
over and over again. You know, studio and live and everything else. It's it's really impressive. Yeah. Um, I did pull up the lyrics because I wasn't sure if we're going to need it or not. And I think we do. Just give me an idea. So this is a cover. So somebody else wrote this initially. Apparently this is written by Shino, Shina Ringo. But the lyrics, I'm just going to, just, just a quick overview if I can. Uh, so you're on my street in the morning, stinks my cheeks. I throw away an empty pack of cigarettes in my tiny little room with no place for me to even stand indulges the loneliness I feel. So don't love me restless shrieking. Don't look to the future. Just live in the moment. Something you can be confident in. Call out my name. Touch my body. All they need is this. Acknowledge me. So just furthermore, the, the loneliness and the, just that cry. I mm-hmm. love you. I'm bawling all alone and it feels so pointless to be fumbling my way down the road at night. The cheap fl- fluorescent lights of the ticket gate don't even give you a shadow ah that warp distant and uncertain day smells like seven stars tasting them brings me right back to that time of the year the fact that i wish for anything at all goes well beyond contradiction your voice was more precious to me than anything in the world did i make that horse too a german car police car sirens roaring the real world she's just painting a picture here Obviously, mm-hmm. fighting through loneliness and interpretation is, as Otto does is just so like. It, th- there's there's obviously drama added to it. There's like angst and maybe some hate and regret and loneliness. It's like she knows how to just like pull on all of these strings at the same time. Yeah. To and paint the picture so, without even a, having the lyrics. Of course, this is an English generic translation right. too. So. I feel like there is a lot of just her own truth that's just poured into this which is always cool when you find an artist that's just giving it all you know giving bearing their soul to the world all right let's yeah. keep seeing let's where keep this going. takes us here controlled chaos going on the bass lines the, the drums going off now too with like the off accents and everything just i mean she puts together a band and she's she's like she's like a kid still it, i mean i'm old right but wait how old is Otto? she's 21 and this song came out what is this? Two years ago. She's 19. Probably tracked it at 18, 19. To have that artistic sensibility, I, I don't know how else to say it, but just, I mean, her musician, she, yeah. she's a musician with her voice. It's not just a singer. Well, it, just in her voice, it's like she's able to encapsulate this this feeling of angst, loneliness, um, uh, you know, like got the bluesy edge, and then also... You know, just the passion, but also like the sexiness that's with it too. You know, it's there like, is kind of creates that. It's like that. That's what the song is is calling for. It's like this loneliness, and you just you want that touch, and that's that, yeah. that little the element. Um, it, whilst you know, screaming her face off, it's like it's just <laughs> it's like it it's is. repelling you and pulling you in at the same time. Yeah, you you wouldn't think something like that has like that that little sexy touch in it. It, it, it definitely does. Good point. Yeah. Listen to these musicians here too. Just like, just what who she surrounds herself with and who she is attracted to in her 
mm -hmm. uh, production and everything is just amazing. There's no auto tune happening there. That's, I was uh, just gonna say that it, it's completely her. Yeah. There's there's you know, no. First of all, you 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 really can't auto tune or melodyne something like that because of too all many the textures. Colors, yeah. It doesn't recognize like that that texture. But God, it would ruin it if she did that. Like yeah. As much as we've been conditioned as a as a society and world to like this sort of perfected sound over right. the past. 15 to 20 years when when autotune started like becoming prominent um you know i mean and people still obviously love that stuff but i think there there is an element deep down that people still want to hear something authentic and they want the imperfections they want the human touch which uh you know with with as as ai and all this technology is coming to the forefront right uh, that's that's comforting to know that people still want that because as a musician you just like uh, you know is is my position going to be obsolete as a performer and right. a writer and producer like when you have this this super machine that can do everything and do it perfectly and you know i think people still connect to that that human element of of music you can't replace artists like this because you can't make the the, the life experiences come through in the delivery. You can mimic it, you can create a an, an example of it, but not for a suspended, suspended time. And that's not gonna fill a stadium like this voice will. Um, and no. I, so I love that she does. And again, she's so young too. So it's just like, it, you get decades of this coming. She's a type of artist that I always wish I could be. And I think a lot of people wish they could be to have just that, that total like, um, the blinders to what people think she just she's in her own world and she probably i don't know there's probably an element where she is she is conscious of it but maybe you just get the sure. music that she's just like she's just holed up in a room and she just does her art the way she wants to do it and she yeah. performs it the way she wants to perform it and you know the fact that she's not seen purposely you know like that that sort of would suggest that it's like i it, think it, it supports is, that yeah yeah I, so I mean, it could be viewed as gimmicky or whatever, but I, I I would counter that very quickly with the idea that you've got someone that young who decided not to be seen public, you know, in her teens. I mean, that talk about a sense of maturity and removing the ego, and 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 I think yeah. you have to in order for her to spill her art in this way, like you're saying, you have to have an awareness, but also a separation. Yeah, I mean, especially yeah, at that age, there. it's like, who, who doesn't want that acclaim? And the <laughs> totally. Just adore that. You know, they, yeah. they want their, their identity, you know, it's like, and she's just, she's purposely not doing that. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, she just so cool. goes for it. <laughs> Yeah. 
Last section makes like now I want to hear her sing like an old jazz standard, like she's just she like probably that. Probably would. <laughs> that just that sexy clear tone, little breathiness. Yeah. It's like a richness in her. Oh, I missed it. Sorry. Yes. I'm not eager to just do a Korean song. Just, I would love it. Even the way they end the song is just weird and cool. <laughs> it you know, is. Just, I love it. Like, yeah, I mean, that's that's the type what of thing, a trip. you know. Rip. Even even when they're laying down the instruments, like you're saying, every there's just this this chaos, which. For somebody that doesn't give a crap about what anybody thinks or trying to fit into some box, like throw it in there. Just do it. <laughs> it feels good. Throw it in there. You but know? it's and not. It's, but it's never. None of this ever sounds like it was thrown in there for the sake of filler either. It's just no, no, yeah. no. But it's just it's it's excess. And they're like, I don't care if it's excess. I like it. So. She would be wild to see live, even though you don't see her live. But obviously, just the the idea of what she does with her voice, song after song to sustain mm-hmm. that that rubber band whiplash of clear tone to grit to breathy like all of these things and then with a band that's that good it would be yeah. an amazing Great concert too. I love the it's my favorite part too yeah but modulated up the G minor so in G minor that, but then it breaks into this G major beat it See. Or wait, what is that? Uh, well, that wasn't it. <laughs> no, that was the other. <laughs> no, but there was but, it. It gave it gives you a sense of like this, almost like this false hope musically, you know, mm-hmm. mixed in with the lyric as it goes to the major sound. Yeah, just just an interesting chord progression, which yeah, everyone knows out there that's seen our channel knows that I love that. So that's yes. why that's why I bought this shirt. I knew it was going to be a big day. <laughs> Absolutely. Big shirt for a big artist. Awesome. Well, thank you everybody for the recommendation. And in the comments, please be sure to let us know where we should go next in the Mm -hmm. auto rabbit hole of chaos. Great. Yes. (laughs) All right. Thanks for joining everybody. Have a great day. Bye. See you guys.